Welcome to today's vlog. It's gonna be a full day of eating, hence why I'm showing you my smoothie. Um, first meal of the day. It's the week of the Arnold, so definitely trying to stay like right around my macros and just kind of eat healthy to feel good. I'm gonna have a couple really, really long days this week. Um, so making sure I'm feeling my body properly is the main goal. So yeah, first meal of the day is my smoothie. Just finished up that shoulder workout. I think I recorded everything. Um, we finished off with the handstands and then some abs. So those things were great. I think he called them sunrise, like you had dumbbells in like a front raise position and then in like a V position and then in like a neutral grip lateral raise, but you switched every time you went up so you'd have your arms straight up, go to a V, sit up, go to a lateral raise, sit up, back to, um, like a front raise position. So that was really good. I gotta go home, make sure the video is ready to post, and then we're going to train my clients. I need to get my nails done today. I need to ship out another package today. I got a lot to do. So I need to make myself a list, first of all, to make sure I don't forget anything. But it's gonna be a good day, good morning. I hope you guys are having a wonderful start to your Tuesday, and I hope you had a great weekend. Yeah, let's get right into the video. looking super cute that's fine I'm in between training clients right now and I just brought one scoop of um, hello what's it called blueberry cheesecake so that is gonna be my snack um, recently for the past like two weeks I've just been bringing a protein bar but I didn't really want to have a protein bar today because it they're normally pretty high in fat and I'd rather have like avocado or peanut butter or something like that, um, or at least just like leave it as an option for the end of the day. So this is like a little over a scoop of the blueberry cheesecake. I'm just gonna have it 
in water. I wanted to make a mess. Yummy! Gosh, I need to get my nails done so bad. They're all, they all started chipping, so I just like ripped them off. Okay. Meal number two, protein shake, because I'm on the go, and that's just easy. Yum. It's been a minute since I've just drank this with water. Very good. All right. I'm gonna train my next two clients. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. is like the first time I like my skin is breaking out because I was stressed out over the weekend <sighs> pale <laughs> haven't showered yet it's fine um, I haven't had my clear skin cocktail yet so one scoop BCAs I have been using the cherry I think I still like the apple cider more just because apple cider tastes really really good to me um, cherry's good it's what I use today greens and two scoops collagen which is one serving and my lunch mm, 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 buffalo chicken with a sweet potato sounds weird um i also this is 140 grams of chicken the potato was a little small so the chicken to potato ratio is a hair off but that's totally fine so this is my lunch then I have to head over to my dad's, ship out some packages, get the packages that are there. I'm hoping one of them is my other Bomar Nutrition package. I don't know what else would be over there. So we'll see. Feeling so much better, <laughs> finally showered. Um, that lunch tasted so good. I do have this little bar that I'm going to take with me. This little, it's like Luna chocolate peanut butter. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna take that with me to my dad's because I have to go ship out two packages, like I said, and then I'm picking up two packages. I'm probably gonna help him with some stuff while I'm there, and then I'm getting my nails done and toes done at three. So, probably won't be home before that, so I'm gonna take that just in case, and I'm already kind of hungry again <laughs> because I'm always hungry. But, yeah, so I'm gonna head off and do that bring this little guy and then I also need to get another thing of water or just fill it up at my dad's because I'm already out for the day. I've been drinking so much water recently. It's been good getting back into it. Um, I have a lot of people ask me like how I drink so much water during the day. Also side note, this is very random. I just remembered. Um, I get a lot of questions over that buffalo chicken recipe. I will link the video down in the description it's a very easy recipe i just found it on pinterest i use way more chicken it says to just use like three chicken breasts with like basically a whole thing of frank's red hot i put way more chicken in there so the frank's red hot isn't so concentrated per chicken like i'm not getting as much sodium per meal because i have a lot more chicken in there anyway i just get a lot of questions over which video that's in so i'll link that video down below the recipe is linked in that video um now back to water like i was saying i get a lot of questions over like when i used to drink two gallons a day how do you drink two gallons a day how do you drink a gallon a day um how do you get so much water in during the day carrying around the actual gallon 
makes a huge difference. One, you, you see exactly how much water you have left to drink, so it's like a constant reminder to keep drinking. Um, and you always have water in front of you. That was my problem with a little water bottle, like even if I just take a blender bottle around, once it's empty, if I'm like one, not near a place to fill it up, I just don't drink water because I'm out, or I forget to fill it up, but this, it's just always right in front of my face, so I know exactly how much water to drink, um, and I know where I'm at for the day, and it's right there. You know, so that helps me a lot. Get your water in. I'm gonna go over to my dad's. It's finally sunny outside. It like makes me feel so happy. It's not so gray and gloomy. What are you doing? <laughs> Lily's just watching her like, okay. You guys are friends now and it makes me so happy. Oh boy. good oh it's not focusing on them that's fine there's this really pretty pink color I got the same thing done on my toes and now I'm real hungry shocker so I'm gonna have a Greek yogurt with some raspberries this is whoop this is the Greek yogurt I get you know this if you've been following me for even like two weeks or since the last full day of eating. So I'm gonna have one of these with some raspberries. And then we'll be eating dinner soon. I don't know what we're gonna have. Maybe some avocado toast. That actually sounds so good. That's probably what we're gonna have. I think I told you guys in the last clip that this sounded good to me and this is what I ended up having for dinner. It's just two pieces of the Dave's Killer Bread, the small version, um, half an avocado split over two of the pieces of toast and then I didn't weigh out the egg whites. It's probably like, 100 grams. yeah, that's what I was gonna say, probably 100 grams, I don't know. This is dinner and then I'm gonna probably have just a protein waffle for um, my last meal of the day, maybe some hot chocolate because that's what I have all the time. It always like helps to curb my cravings. Um, so yeah, this is Din Din. You know the same. This is the hot chocolate I have um, usually every day, 35 calories. Uh, zero fat, five carb, and three protein. I know you can't see that, but you're just gonna have to trust me because my camera doesn't like to focus. for the video I hope you guys enjoyed it um, Chris and I sat down and watched like two more episodes of the Umbrella Academy last night and I passed out um, on the couch so I didn't need anything after I had that protein waffle which I wasn't planning on it so full day of eating was good yesterday <laughs> 
uh, yeah, I'm gonna finish editing the video, get it posted for you guys, and then get to work. And I was talking to Jake today, and I'm gonna start thinking of like something I can, taking a little time for myself each day, and like I need to figure out what would help me decompress during the day. Um, I'm thinking sitting in the sauna, but we will see. 